morning, Red Hawks 360 Nation, and welcome to your R360 Morning Announcements. I'm your host, Micah Martin. And I'm Brooke Adams. Welcome to Thursday, day- May 9th. It is day four on the school calendar. The grade five, six have intramurals today. Meanwhile, the grade three, fours are off to swimming, bowling, and Boston pizza. There's also a senior year's choir today. Meet in Miss Sampson's room. The grade eight boys will have a softball practice tomorrow at noon. Make sure to bring your gloves. Things are heating up in the National Hockey League playoffs with round two ending last night with the San Jose Sharks defeating the Colorado Avalanche in seven games. Playoff hockey pool standings are hot off the press with Lord Marina continuing her dominance in these playoffs. Noah Peters and the rest of the top nine have two series remaining to take down Lorena and claim the $25 gift card prize. In classroom standings, the grade sevens moved to top spot one point ahead of the surging grade eight class. Stay tuned for more updates after round three. To paraphrase Claude Levi Strauss, a scientist is not a person who gives the right answer. They are the ones who ask the right questions. And ask the right questions our student scientists did. Yesterday, students participated in workshops led by Women in Science and Engineering, or the WISE Kinetic Energy Program from University of Manitoba. Students participated in different workshops where they got to use polymer chemistry to create about their their own bouncy balls, learn about indigenous structures on Turtle Island, built a catapult to launch tape balls around the room, and much more. Thank you to Miss Lopez for accompanying the accompanying the students to J.A. Cuddy. To all you listening, watch out for your budding young scientists who came home with new knowledge and many more questions. Let's take a quick look. What I enjoyed most about today was uh, was probably the um, science on the run. I got it. ASL club for grade fives to eight starting tomorrow from 11:50 to 12:25 in the learning center. We hope to see all interested students who are interested in American Sign Language there. Stay tuned for video invite on tomorrow's news. And finally, it's trivia Thursday today. Our prize this morning is compliments of old hat. Nathan Duick has generously donated a $50 gift card to a shop. Let's take a look at the question. Hi, Red Hawk Nation. It's Nathan Dua, class of 2000, and I'm here at Third and Bird with Old Hat, and I'm bringing you your Thursday trivia question. How many stitches are in one baseball cap? Answer is 2000. Have a great day at school. And the winner is Mr. Sharpenberg's class. Congratulations. Please have a student come down from the broadcast center to claim your prize. Before we sign off, a very happy birthday going wish going out to Tabia High today and also Miss Ferrard. Happy birthday! That's all for announcements this morning. From all of us at the R360 Newsroom, have a great day.